The Danish NGO Dane Church Aid has begun a project to mitigate the risk of unexploded ordnance or UXO and support victims in the provinces of Sengkuang and Huapan. The National Regulatory Authority and Dane Church Aid signed a memorandum of understanding for the project, which will cost over 579,000 euros. Program Manager for Dane Church Aid's Humanitarian Mine Action in Southeast Asia, Bjorn Using, and Director General of the National Regulatory Authority, Pukio Jantasumbun, signed the agreement. The project is funded by the European Union and DCA and will be implemented by DCA and Norwegian Church Aid in collaboration with the Lao Buddhist monkhood. It will take place in Kham and Baek districts of Sengkwang province and in Kua and Mai districts of Pongsali province. According to Bijan Osing, Lao people had suffered from UXO-related accidents for decades after the munitions were dropped in a conflict that Laos was not even a part of. He said farmers who want to cultivate food for their communities, poor people who want to help their families through income earned from the sale of scrap metal from cluster bombs, and curious children who just want to explore the world have all been victims of death or injury from explosions. The project is being realized thanks to strong commitment from local people and the support of the authorities who will take part in the fight against accidents from these explosive devices. From 2008 to 2014, 13 people had died and 12 were injured in Pung Sali province in UXO-related accidents. In Sengkuang province, 38 people were killed and 197 were wounded. According to the National Regulatory Authority, over 44,000 hectares of land have been cleared of UXO since 1996, up to 37% of the country's total land area, about 87,000 kilometers, up to 37% of the country's total land area, about 87,000 square kilometers may be contaminated with various types of unexploded ordnance. <laughs> Dead.